Hi guys, it's Patricia and today I'm going to do my Scentsy Club edit with you guys. What I'm going to do is flip the camera around, I'm going to film the edits of both clubs <laughs> and we'll see how it goes. There were some glitches on the weekend uh, when it first launched so let's see if I can do this properly. Okay, so here we are and we have my main Scentsy Club. Now I have two and I will explain when I get to the second one. What you'll see on this screen is that I have always set up my club to come every three months no matter what. So if you're someone that has a monthly or a bi-monthly subscription, I am not personally able to fiddle around with mine so I can explain how to fiddle around with yours, but if you are one of my customers, message me and we'll video chat and I will, we will walk through it together. So as you go down, you will see my next order is due to ship August 18th. So usually around 10 days before that, around August 8th or so, it will lock. So I still have lots of time to make changes, you can see I have 30 items in here right now and what my total is, it's a little bit high. So we're gonna just click on this and it's saying the first thing I can do is skip August. Now I'm not gonna skip August because I actually skipped February of 2020 and you have to wait a full calendar year before you can skip again or you will lose your discontinued bars. I am going to tap down. Now it says I have earned a half price item so we'll do that towards the end. But let's just go through. I have sweet plum pastry. I am gonna keep that in. I was thinking about removing it because I have a feeling it's gonna come back in a bring back my bar very soon. But what I will do is if I know it's coming back for a bring back my bar, I will actually take it out for one or two cycles and then put it back in when it's due to retire. My second scent is marshmallow mint, which is probably my favorite Scentsy scent. It's a light to medium marshmallow mint fragrance. That is not going anywhere. Then I have banana berry. Now, banana berry is one of those scents that I rather enjoyed surprisingly. It's a fruity banana strawberry scent with a touch of marshmallow, and it lasted a fairly am good amount of time for me, so I'm actually going to leave that in. I just don't want to take it out. Hazelnut frosting. That is one that I absolutely love. That one's not going to be removed. Cozy spice. I really like that one. It's a medium to soft scent, but I love it mixed with happy birthday or just on its own. And Rosemary Mint, those were my first six pack. Oh, that one is probably gonna stay for now. It's probably gonna be removed depending on how we do. So let's just see. So far I haven't done anything. Love and Happiness is not going anywhere. I love that one. Wooly Slippers is a great mixer. Happy Birthday is a great foodie mixer, so those are staying. Sugar is probably in my top 10, so that's not going anywhere. Now I did add Pink Cotton in, and I really enjoy that one. It's a great performer, does well for my main area, so I'm gonna leave that in. Now, here we have Pacific Sandalwood. I have not smelled that because I have not received my um, order with the International Wax Collection, but I know from the tester that one was a really up my alley, so I'm gonna leave that one in. So what I've done uh, maybe two weeks ago is I kinda went in and, and made some changes, so you're probably not gonna see a lot of changes on this one, but I'll go through it with you guys anyway in case you wanted to see. And up in the top of the Simply Vanilla and some of the other bars, you'll see a little lock. And if you click on that, it says this Scentsy Wax Bar is discontinued. You will continue to receive this item only as long as it stays in your Scentsy Club subscription. The quantity may not be increased. So one change that they've made, let me just get rid of that little note. You can actually change how often you get things now. So if you're getting it every three months and you want it every month, you can do that. So the frequency you can up or or decrease. The quantity, once you pick your quantity, that's it. You cannot, um, you can decrease, that's easy. You cannot increase, okay? So just remember that. Coffee tree, I like that. I'm probably gonna keep that. It's a, just a basic coffee scent, good as a mixer. Peppermint Dreams, I really like that scent. I'm thinking about removing it only because I have a feeling it's gonna come back and bring back my bar soon and I have a huge amount stockpiled. But I'm probably gonna keep it in for now because I'm just not doing a great job on my edit. <laughs> now the funny thing is those don't have the little lock symbols but those are no longer available so I'm not really sure. Let's just, for fun, let's try to increase it and see what it says. Oh, it let me increase it. Well, that's odd. Okay, I'm gonna go back to one. <laughs> anyway, good to know. Summer Rain is no longer available, but I really like that one. It's really nice for a bedroom or bathroom in the spring and summer. 
White Sands. I'm going to keep that one because I really do enjoy that one. It's great, uh, so relaxing and calming. Okay, strawberry and rock melon. Again, I have not smelled the International Wax Collection. This was the one tester that I wasn't crazy about. Most people really like this one, but my family is a big fruity fan, so I'm gonna keep that one in until I smell it, until I figure out what I'm gonna do. Okay, so here we have Jelly Belly. We finally have a change. I'm gonna be removing a lot of these, um, what do you call them? Licensed collections because I basically had a six pack just for the purpose of keeping stitch. So we're gonna remove Jelly Belly. It says, are you sure you want to remove this item? Yes, remove it or keep this item in my uh, subscription. So we're gonna remove it, goodbye. Stitch is staying, not your everyday dragon. I have warmed one cube of that uh, my daughter loves that one. I do not. <laughs> so I'm going to remove it. We'll just finish the bar that we have. So again, remove this. Yes, please. My goal is to get this from 30 down to, I don't know what. Mandalorian, Air of Adventure. I have not warmed that, but I have two bars. And on Cold Snip, it wasn't a huge standout. I'm not going to cry myself to sleep if I don't have more, even if I really like it. I have to pay more for that. I have to pare things down. So I'm going to get rid of both. There's two in there. Goodbye, uh, Baby Yoda. All right, there we go. Phineas and Ferb. Now, every time I look at this guy, I picture me looking at him again. <laughs> Phineas and Ferb, I have not yet warmed. Um, on Cold Sniff, it wasn't a huge standout for me. Uh, you really have to decide what are huge standouts. So what you want to keep in your club, in my opinion, are outstanding, um, scent with scent for scent appeal for you, like you absolutely love the scent, or it's a great performer, or it lasts a long time, or it's nice and strong, or a combination of all those things. So sometimes if it doesn't check all the boxes, I'm not keeping it. So Phineas and Ferb, it was okay on scent appeal, but I think I'm gonna remove it. Goodbye. All right, Beach Daisy. Beach Daisy is one that I'm on the fence about. I have a stockpile of it, but. I think that if I remove it, I won't warm it <laughs> because I'll hoard it. So for now, I'm going to keep that one in. Cinnamon Vanilla. I put it in and I have a couple of bars. I think I have three bars maybe. And there's just so many scents that I have to warm. I think I'm going to remove it. Uh, it does well in my home, but there's going to be other ones. I'm just going to be responsible and remove it. Here we go. I did it. All right, Johnny Appleseed. I have that in another Scentsy Club, so I'm gonna actually remove it from this one. Goodbye. Mocha Doodle. I actually have a boatload of bars coming, and so I'm actually gonna remove that. Like when I say a boatload, I'm talking a boatload. So we're gonna be reckless and remove it. And some of these scents, you gotta remember, unless it's a scent that most people hated, you're gonna see it come back in a future bring back my bar. So goodbye Mocha Doodle, I love you, but I don't love you as much as I used to, so I'm gonna remove you. <laughs> All right, so we have two left. Lucky Star Fruit, which I have not smelled, but I did like it a lot on Cold Sniff from my little mini tester. I heard it's light, but I'm not a huge fruity fan, but I like that one, so I'm gonna keep it in until I smell it. And window, window Sill Breeze, I am gonna keep that in. So now I am down to, let me just see how many I have in here. Whoa, sorry. I have 22 items, so I got rid of eight. So not the greatest, but this is my main club, and this is the one that kind of matters more to me than the other one. So what I'm gonna do is pick a half-priced item. So you can click on this, choose a half-priced item. So the ones that you'd probably wanna choose would be something like, um, the, the most expensive things are a whiff box and the large tub of washer whiffs, the Scentsy Brick, followed by probably Fragrance Flower and Scent Soft. So if you want to get the most bang for your buck, you're going to pick an expensive item. But I think I'm going to pick Scent Soft because it's kind of expensive and I don't want to pay full, full price, but I do want some. So I think I will pick it in. Let's see. I get it half price, so I'm going to pick... We have Shimmer, Scentsy Clean, Luna, Lavender Cotton, 
Jamie Time Clothesline Black Raspberry Vanilla. I'm going to pick Clothesline because I know I have that. So I'm just going to pick this. I'm going to add it and we'll see what happens. Your order will process August 18th. It shows I have the half price item and it shows all my items that I'm going to be getting. So there we have it and my price before tax is $186.29. So I'm just going to press update subscription and it says your order will process on August 18th. Details of your order are below. You may edit or add to your order at any time in the Scentsy Club section of your account. Now I didn't show you how to get into the Scentsy Club because sometimes it shows my private information, but if you need to know, I will talk you all through it. Um, if you're one of my customers, just message me and I will tell you. You probably know how to do it, but anyway, I'm going to pause this one and we're going to go into my other one. Okay, so I'm back. So here we are in my daughter's Scentsy Club subscription. So what happened was, I'll just tell you, I wanted a brick one time quickly. I didn't want to have to wait because mine would have to ship, I think it was almost two or three months because I had just received, I think, my order. Then I, I really wanted a sugar brick. So I set one up for my daughter and I thought I'll just put some some things in her club so that I can get some scents that she likes or maybe some scents that I'm not huge about. So I kept my, that one and I was thinking about totally getting rid of it, but there's a couple of bars in here I really want. So I'm going to fiddle around with this so I can keep it. So here you see again, monthly is nothing, bi-monthly is nothing. Quarterly, I have 12 items in this, and so my pre-tax total is 95.40. So we're going to click on this, and this is all Canadian, by the way. So it says skip October. There's a great chance I am going to skip this in October because I just figure I might as well skip it, And but we'll see. So it says you've earned a half-price item, but I'm going to be making some changes. So let's see how I do by the time I make changes. First one, watermelon tangerine. I have a bar that I haven't shown you guys the haul. I just got this order actually, and I haven't shown you the haul. So I think I have a couple of those. It's it's okay for me, um, not super, super strong. So I'm gonna actually remove watermelon tangerine. It should give me a warning. And yes, I'm gonna remove this. The next one is picked for you. I do really like that scent. It's a pretty good scent for me on scent appeal and it's a really great performer. So I'm gonna leave that one in. Hibiscus water is one of the ones I really kind of like. It lasts forever. It's a nice medium scent, but I really like that. Great for a bathroom, bedroom, laundry room. So I'm gonna leave hibiscus water. My Hero is one of the ones that I wanna get some more of. And, and oh no, I can't change the quantity because it got the little lock signal. But uh, My Hero is actually on back order, so I didn't get that in my most recent club order. So I will actually keep that in. Johnny Appleseed, I deleted from my other club, so I'm gonna keep that here. Rainbow Sherbert, I think I'm gonna keep maybe just for a little bit, and then I'll remove. Now Beach Daisy I had in my other club, so I can remove this. Yes. Happy Birthday I had it in my other club, so I can remove it here. White Sands I had in my other club, so I can remove it here. Now Blueberry Rush, I do have quite a few stockpiled. For my family loves that one. I'm the only one who doesn't like it, so I'm kind of keeping it in the, there for them. And I actually have a local customer that really likes it, so I'm probably gonna, let me see. I wanna try to get this down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Hmm, maybe I'll, I'm gonna delete Grape Granita because it kind of smells weird lately. It smells like it has a tobacco undertone, like, a t like the actual tobacco cigarette. Not not a lit cigarette, <laughs> just to, I'm gonna get rid of it. So let's just get rid of that. Rainbows and butterflies, I actually have quite a few of those. Hmm. Rainbow Sherbert, I'm pretty confident is gonna come back. And, and let's be honest, I'm probably not gonna warm that anytime between now and when it comes back. So I'm gonna remove, remove a Rainbow Sherbert. So what, do I, what am I at here? I have one, Two, three, four, five. I have six. Okay, well maybe what I should do is remove Blueberry Rush because I have a lot of those. A lot. Uh, I'm gonna remove Blueberry Rush. That'll leave me with five. One, two, three, four, five, because that was my goal. So let's get rid of Blueberry Rush. 
because I have probably like 10 of them. And so that leaves me with five. And you can see down below here, it says I have five, they're $8 each here in Canada, so that's $40. I get a 10% discount of $4, but my shipping is $9. But I want to I add a few things in because there's, I want to try to get to the half price item and there's things that I always forget so to add to regular items. So I have them written down. So the first thing I'm going to do is go down to, way down to the bottom, light bulbs. And because I have local customers that often need bulbs, this is never going to go to waste, even if I don't go through bulbs. I'm going to add a 15 watt three pack. Uh, add more products. I am going to add a 25 watt bulb three pack. Add more products. I am going to go out of here and I'm going to add a cotton cleanup once every three months. Add more products. And the other thing I want to add should get me to $80 Canadian is a Scentsy soap because I go through these and I forget to order them. And let's see, I have all these ones to choose from. We've tried aloe water and cucumber, apricot vanilla, blue grotto. Have we tried that one? I think. Um, I think I've tried most of these, but I think because it's one of my favorites, I'm going to get sea salt and avocado. I think it makes the water green, but that's okay. I'm okay with swamp water. We'll go for it. <laughs> okay, so let's see review subscription and see what happens. Okay, so it's still showing that I'm on quarterly. It's showing that my order will process October 14th. So usually I can cancel at any time up to around the 4th, I believe. And yes, I'm back up to the $80. Let's just tab down. I'm actually at 81, but it's just because of the shipping is a dollar more. So for adding a half price item for this, like I said, your best options are a whiff box, a brick, uh, the washer whiffs, large tub, scent soft, fragrance flower, but I'm gonna also add something that I often forget to add and I really want this scent and it is going to be, if I can find it, all-purpose concentrate cleaner and Johnny Appleseed because I know I have one of these but I really love Johnny Appleseed in the cleaning line so I am going for it so let's just review I've got my bulbs two different types of bulbs which is great you should probably go for that even if you're a customer and you could change it you can get rid of them easily just adjust it cotton cleanups nice treat for me sea salt and avocado another treat for me my Johnny Appleseed cleaner at half price and then this one has five bars now I probably might edit a couple of these bars out but we'll see and that is where I'm going to stop and let it stand for now and we'll see how things go so that is it that is my Sensi Club edit for now <laughs> I'm sure there'll be changes as we go because most addicts can't stick to anything but I hope this video was helpful or at least entertaining in some way and I will see you guys in the next video